Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Let's Play Rebuild Gangs of Deadville. Now, um, last time I lost footage of this very town, and I'm still, I'm almost linked up to my original footage. But not quite. There's a few things I need to take care of, I suppose. Now this, that's just a random rescue mission. I believe I revealed the third fraction, fraction, faction before I did anything else, so... Huh. I can tell you that the Rifts did not raid me during, uh... <laughs> God. Well, that's awesome. I can tell you that the Rifts did not raid me during the original playthrough. Or my actions may have been completely different. What happened in my original playthrough is that the Last Judgment Gang were raiding me a whole lot, and eventually... I decided to stop taking crap from them, and I raided them back, so... Let's repeat history and see what happens. Um, I'm not sure... Wait, let me see here. What did that just say? Yeah, scavengers steal better stuff, so... Alright, so I'm gonna... Oh, I should bring Jenkins. Jenkins! Perhaps we should steal. And then the soldiers are just so that, you know, the scavengers don't die. Oh god, they got soldiers right over me. Strange sightings! Now, this, is, this has already come up before, but, you know... The rotten are here. I think I'm just going to investigate the subway really quick. The The amount of zombie attacks that are happening are completely insane, by the way. So we're going to greet the Rotten, and that's going to start out a friendly relationship with them. That I'm surely going to have to sloggingly, uh, <laughs> sloggingly improve since I can't reach them through normal means since the rifts have completely blocked me off. Ugh. The Last Judgment is uh, at war with me. What, the only reason I made this part of the recording, besides to reveal the rotten, because that was supposed to happen, was that in the original recording, a storyline scene happened where the Last Judgment sent me um, a little message, but I'm not going to get into that because I'm sure it'll come up eventually. I think what happened here, though, is that I pushed my luck a little bit too much. I, pro I What I seem to remember happening was I raided them once and then just went about my business. And eventually the Last Judgment were just like, we're at war now. And I've never been at war with a faction before, it's a little bit different. What I'm going to do is completely dismantle their power structure and destroy them utterly. And instead of allying, that's how we will resolve this. Now the best way to set this up, first of all, is to first, if you can, build right next to their base. This isn't necessary and it can actually cause some trouble in the uh, defensive department. But if you do that, when you attack someone, then you will gain their base for you. As opposed to just destroying it and turning it into zombie plays. So now that I've captured this farm, when I destroy this, which I'm going to destroy, then uh, I will capture it. Now, if I explain that again, that's because I'm now finally going back to the original footage. You will see the aftermath of this attack. Of course, for all I know, it's an attack here. But it's an attack somewhere with sufficient forces, I assure you. Whew, it's nice to finally be caught up again to the original. So you'll notice that first of all they lost two tiles because it was a two tile building. They hate us more, not that they can hate us more because I'm pretty sure they're, they're at minimum. And uh, they lost some faction strength. Now faction strength determines how powerful they are. Now I could attack soldiers, but that's dangerous because uh, soldiers are more powerful. But if I do that, then it'll eliminate some of their ability to attack me back. Also, I need to find their headquarters. If you kill their headquarters, they lose almost all of their faction strength. And it looks like he's planning to attack. Who cares? Like, seriously, who freaking cares? Alright, let's go on for another attack. I think the man is gonna personally attack this McNoodles. That's really dangerous. I just think he can do it. I think he'll be fine. The rest are gonna attack this. Alright, let's see if Shoeless can defend. <laughs> Um, we're gonna bribe the Last Judgment with medical supplies. There we go. You take those medical supplies, you idiots. <laughs> they really, they really shouldn't have done that. Alright, so we got this. Alright, our, our ragtag gang of uh, defenders was able to do that. The city now has electricity. And everyone defend here instead. The man has actually been uh, taken out. Wow, see, this description is not becoming of the man, and dumb. He did not actually say that. This is conjecture that the game is thrusting upon him. They are incorrectly writing for the man, and I don't approve of it. 
But, uh, oh, it looks like the other group did succeed, however. They took the suburb over there. Let's see, someone is... Oh, he has a... I forgot I found a whip and gave him a whip. So he used to be part of the Rifts. That's pretty cool. But we're going to give him melee training because he really needs to, to go for this. Also, let's go to the Rifts and see if I can get some more weapons for, uh, you know, for this fight against their bitter enemies. And I still don't see the uh, the Last Judgment headquarters. It would be good to make a line for them. Oh, great. Extra dangers from zombies for the next few days. That's all we need. Oh, that's right. I forgot. What did I What did I even do? Uh, oh, you can have two explosives. Here you go. <laughs> what the hell? They just... Oh, okay. He just, he just used them. He used some uh, explosives. All right. We should be... Uh, we should be fine. Yeah. Um, oddly enough, I'm gonna give you guys, like, all, all of the time off, because I don't need any of you right now. We're fighting a war. Is there anything that'll help us here? I mean, preemptive strikes is really far away. And, I mean, none of this matters anymore, does it? Whatever, I guess we'll just keep on doing it for fun. <laughs> um, let's continue the war! Oh, and a giant zombie horde. Looks like they, uh, looks like a giant zombie horde attacked down there and wiped out one of their things, so that's cool. Whoa, what? Father O'Grady met us at the gate with a gruff handshake. He took us through the cathedral to look up at the giant crucifix of the hall. He quoted, Behold, the Lord shall come in fire, and his chariots like a whirlwind, to render his anger with fury, and his rebuke with flames of fire, for the Lord will execute judgment by fire, and by his sword and all flesh, those slain by the Lord may be many. I'm not sure if this was a threat or their mission statement, but he's obviously in a real hellfire mood. Negotiate peace. Interesting. After long hours of negotiation, our meeting devolved into a shouting match. I'm not totally sure what happened, but it's probably our fault. Yeah, I'm sure it's our fault. You guys are the ones who started this, kind of. I mean, I did intentionally piss them off, but they are the ones who started it. O'Grady says that there can be peace between us if we straight up pay for them. Screw you! You should pay me, dummies! You gotta be kidding me! Like, ser you seriously have to be kidding me. That's ridiculous. Yeah, if they offered to pay me, I would do bad. I'd give you all the peace. Also, I didn't even know I had a golf club. But he might get bored, but recreation has the perk. Prevents boredom. So as he's preaching, he'll just be, like, chopping with his sword, I guess. Um... Can I do the thing that I meant to do here, which was not talk to them, it was trade with them? Uh, so there's that, first of all. And I used up every zombie trap. Yeah, I had the exact amount of zombie traps I wanted. That's really cool. Boom. Can you uh, reclaim this for me real fast? <laughs> Let's go back to attacking these jerks, then. And we do have, we did have a weapon there, I saw that. Let's see, who doesn't have a weapon? Oh, wow, does everyone have a weapon? Is everyone except you has a weapon, I didn't even realize. Well, in true Rift fashion, you have that. Also, he's probably making enemies, because he, he has a stinky... Yeah. He's got stinky. <laughs> Plus one defense, but harder to make friends. Anyway, attacking the Last Judgment. And boom. Let's trade. I don't even know if I need weapons. Oh, they don't have weapons anyway. I guess we'll buy your medical supplies, just because. Cool. All right, that's a thing that happened. <laughs> oh god, they're attacking. Now, do I count as a defender? I don't. I don't count as a defender. All right, well, we're going to have to take that back. But uh, we're take. Oh, no. See, I was going to claim this automatically, but now it's going to become a neutral zombie square. <laughs> Malik delivered a message for Alex Broski today. Apparently the Rips have turned of his badass skills and want to see how he does in a real fight. If we're willing, Ale Malik wants to pit him against one of their champions. It's a fight not to the death, but to the pain. Actually, I have no idea what sort of fight this will be, but they assured me that we'll probably live through it. Let's accept the fight. <laughs> oh yeah, the match lasted into the night with a lot of pasturing and near misses, neither fighter giving any ground. After the third break, just as the clock struck midnight, Alex dropped their champion with a stunning German suplex. Afterward, Malik seemed to look at us with a newfound respect. He even bowed to us before dragging their fallen champion back home. We just gained 10 respect from the Rifts because Alex Broski defeated them in single combat, which I think is pretty badass. So, unfortunately, 
I wonder if I can stop this attack temporarily and then build real quick. Is that a thing that can happen? Because that'd be amazing. Oh. Stop. Attack these guys instead. Do -do 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 -do. What? Oh. <laughs> that was the area that the man was uh, taking care of previously. So it was pretty much cleared out of people anyway. Alright, let's attack again. And boom. Alright. Oh, so gender roles. Let's have, um... Women should stay at home. That'll piss off every woman in our fort. But, uh, we're gonna do... People can do whatever the hell they want. I don't care. That is, like, the neutral response. Um... You, you can you can totally clear this up right by yourself. I'm sure you can. It won't even be a problem for you. And you can kill these two zombies. Boom. Oh. <laughs> Alright, the man's not Superman. He's close. But not quite. Alright, we got that. And... Boom. <laughs> so now that whole segment belongs to us. Uh, I want to take... I mean, you guys are probably cool. You guys... <laughs> You guys are fine, right? Alright, there's pretty much no zom- Wow, the roaming zombies are back. That's lame. That's really lame. Uh, can we make a few more zombie traps so I don't need to, like, capture these things manually? That would be nice. Um, I mean, I really don't need them doing anything. I guess I can just take time off. You can just capture this for me. But, alright, the man should be joining these attacks, but instead I'm, I'm being dumb with him. Alright. Oh yeah, that's right. I needed a scout. That's why I was looking over there. To see if I can spy their base, because I don't... It's it's a church. Like, every faction always has the same base. Like, they're... Alright, it was right next to me. The, um... Oh, crap. Uh, bribe the last judgment. <laughs> you guys are idiots for taking my bribes. You're catching me unaware. And they're still just like, oh, okay, we'll just take the building materials. Why, because it makes them feel awesome that they, they extorted me? Probably. Well, that's cool. I got the spotting spies. That means I can do the preemptive strikes, possibly. It'll have you help with zombie traps. Alright. Attacking. Is the man okay yet? No, he's not okay yet. <laughs> there, we got another one. A few of our sneakier people slipped past the last judgment walls last night and poisoned their food stacks while most of them were asleep. We'll see how they sleep tomorrow when a few of them are face first into their breakfast come the morning. <laughs> I can't believe O'Grady was just like, we want peace, and you have to pay for it. I, Minerva, that guy. Uh, but now we're attacking the... Alright, we need the man for this, I think. I'm just gonna raid them real quick. Tee hee hee. I think um, scavengers actually help with raiding. So we're gonna put a scavenger in there with that. Whoa, illness strikes. Is bleeding from the eyes normal? <laughs> we don't have a hospital? You have to be kidding me. We didn't have a hospital this entire time? That's insane to me. I just, I didn't even think about it because, like, the chances of us not randomly reclaiming a hospital is really low. Alright, let's build two hospitals. It's <laughs> to guarantee that type of crap doesn't happen. Good god, she could have died. Whatever, the man is here. He's gonna assist in the raiding. And he's not gonna go, like, crazy Rambo by himself this time. Alright, we raided the last judgment. And we found an assault rifle. That is amazing. Alright, well, thank you very much, sir. You can go back to just guarding this graveyard. <laughs> Alright, let's attack the last Judgment HQ. This will completely sap their strength, and then I can mop up extremely quickly. Oh, uh, and we'll adopt this child. <laughs> we'll have the uh, woman who's bleeding from the eyes do it. I took particular delight in destroying O'Grady's office as we stormed into their headquarters of the church today. If they ever manage to take it back, there's going to be some pretty hilarious graffiti in there. They seem to be pretty demoralized by the loss of the building. And the stuff we found. Seventeen food and a shotgun. Alex Broski, who <laughs> defeated a rift in single combat. So now if we look at my government thingy... Or rather, my faction thingy. You'll notice that their faction strength is absolute crap. They cannot defend against me properly. They're pretty much screwed. So that means if I take just just the man, that like you notice the uh, danger wasn't nearly as high that time. It's because they are weakened severely. And I still want to try to attack squares that are uh, next to my base if I want to actually capture those squares. Let's see, will you be safe if I take you away? Yes. Alright, now everyone, this is all safe attacking now. 
Except that soldier might... Oh no, that's a Rift soldier. Whatever. And it looks like a Last Judgment Raider has appeared. Blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Uh, hey, Last Judgment Raider. How about I kill you? Let's see. Let's check another one of these. The Last Judgment defenses were impressive, but they didn't stand a chance against our soldier. We busted our way through their compound and trashed up everyone who raised a weapon against us before heading the out the way we came. The Last Judgment won't be hanged, but they should think twice about... Well, of course, they're going to think twice about messing with us. We destroyed their freaking headquarters. They don't even have a place to call home. All right, we built a hospital. That's good. Killed the raiders. Excellent. Let's take this. We ended up in a drawn-out gunfight with the Last Judgment raiders, but they were obviously overmatched. After we picked off the first couple, the rest ran back towards their base. We'll have to finish the fight there if we want to finish them off. Will do. And currently doing. <laughs> there, we got another square. Boom. I'm gonna take this also. Now, assuming this uh, top building gets taken first. Oh, well, the Last Judgment just got overrun also. We spotted O'Grady running around in a panic earlier as Zed broke through one of their big farms. I guess the war has weakened them enough in their defenses that they can't keep us and the zombies out. The Last Judgment lost a big farm. So, I don't even know where that was. It might not even be on the map yet, because there is more to scout, it looks like. So we're going to scout over here just so I can see if there's any more of them over here. There might be. And there's a damn zombie horde, because that that place wasn't reclaimed by us. Please tell us I have one explosive. I have Oh, but I've been making zombie traps. Cool. At least I won't have to worry about that after this. Oot. I'm tired of the the man is tired of not being a singular badass. All right, let's let's just move them both off the last judgment. And take care of the zombie horde real quick. That is still important after all. All right, <laughs> and last judgment got overrun again. I saw it that time in that suburb, but we're gonna finish them off here. I believe these are la the last two squares. Now, if you take their last two squares, the faction is done, and they can't they are counted as defeated. Excellent. Pow. Reclaim this real fast, please. Excellent. I'm gonna join in the final attack. All soldiers rush. Pow. The Last Judgment put up a serious fight in their final rubble. We surrounded the walls and demanded they surrender. They answered with gunfire. I guess they'd rather go out with guns a-blazing than submit to us. Hell, I can understand that. The smarter ones laid their guns down and put their hands up. What should we do with them? We're going to let them go. We gave O'Grady and the rest of them as much food as they could carry, then ordered them to leave Midtown and never look back. They look pretty disheartened as they trudged out of town, but our people are happy to let them live. And we did get a gun of some sort, or I don't know if it was a gun, I'm just assuming it was a gun because it was a gunfight. Uh, I don't know, we have, we have a lot of things. <laughs> we have a whole lot of things. Excellent. So the last judgment are they're done. I don't <laughs> don't have to worry about them ever again, at least not on this map. Uh, now it's just about making friends with the rotten and with uh, and with the rifts. And if I can do that, we can leave town. So this one's a lot more straightforward. As far like you're much more likely to have to uh, do a whole bunch of like these type of missions, especially since I can't reach the dam. Oh, but I just realized. Okay, this is going to be easier than I thought. I don't know what faction level they're at currently, but now that I've destroyed the Last Judgment, I can easily just give uh, the Rifts two buildings back, and they'll be like, you guys are bros. We're, we're, totally, we're totally with you. So I shouldn't even worry, really. And most of my soldiers are ridiculous, crazy badasses right now because they just took out one of the most crazy factions in the game. Uh, you are a camper? And you, Private Russell, you are a light sleeper. That means decreased happiness, but he has more defense on buildings because he's way more likely to be up. And you get melee training. Cool. He's pretty badass with that sword, I gotta say. Alright, and we're just gonna take out these... I don't even have to take out zombies that way, I'm forgetting that I've been having my people make a ton of zombie traps. 
And there is no one... I mean, we killed the last judgment in that rubble over there. <laughs> so I'll just put a trap there so that zombies don't come back before I reclaim it. Because I'm going to give it... <laughs> Here, last judgment. Have this horrible rubble. There we go. Also, Alex Broski, in addition to being a badass uh, in the killing field, is also a badass at making people happy. Cool. All right. Um, all right, so capture you. And I wasn't going to show, like, random, random meetings with the Rotten. I just think it's interesting that I can send uh, Jenkins. Yeah, he gained Rotten Perk. That's completely perfect that he has the Rotten Perk, isn't it? I sent a freaking former Rotten, probably, or the very least. I guess he was probably never part of the Rotten, but, you know, he has the same affliction that the Rotten have. So that's a thing. Um... Yeah, I, I wasn't paying attention, and it turns out that all of my building materials were used up in making zombie traps. So I, I gave the I gave the rifts that place. I just need a few more building materials so that I can give them yet another place. Guess we're gonna blow this up also. Yeah. But if I could just trade I mean now I can trade with you guys. I wanted to trade with the Rotten, but there's no trader, and they don't like me enough for me to just go up there and trade with them. Let's see. Please have building materials. You have so many building materials. My god. <laughs> well, here's a crap ton of food that you don't need because you're the Rotten, and the Rotten don't eat food, but I guess you could use it to trade with other people. And we gave them some medicine, so they'll like me a little bit more. Excellent. All right, now I can stop being a weird face and actually get the rifts on my side. Alright, you can take the pig farm. We don't need it. What we do need is your friendship! Give it to us! Give us your friendship with open arms! Uh, scavenging policy. Balance risk with reward. Alright. Pow! Suggest an Alan declare war! All right, let's do this. Okay, so the Rifts are now an ally. Malik bowed deeply to the crowd, then spread his arms and waited for silence. For too long, he began, we've been fighting over our little piece of turf. But it's our turf, mine and yours. We'll keep it safe. Can you dig it? Yeah, the crowd rode back. Can you dig it? Yeah. CAN YOU DIG IT?! We can. I grabbed Malik's hand and we raised our arms to the sky. <laughs> Once again, that uh, whole speech is related to the Warriors, the 80s movie. But, uh, yep, I'm done. I still need to make friends with the Rotten, but it's gonna take a while. So I'm gonna take care of that next episode. I'm trying to be a little bit less crazy, because a lot of times I have an hour of footage per episode, and that's insane. Because it takes me longer than an hour to edit. So I'm just gonna be I, I'm just gonna have a place where I'm not gonna be able to release this on schedule if I keep this up plus you know I don't want to make the episodes too long all right so or you know be forced to cut out half the damn thing which I have been sort of forced to do sometimes okay city's looking good we're making peace we completely took over the area of the uh, what should we call it faces. I just wish the, the rifts hadn't blocked me off so that I could get to the rotten. It's the same thing that happened to, like, the Dahlias last time. But, um, things are going well, and I'm almost done with it. I'm Crest Knights, and I'll see you guys next time.